Hello ladies, uh, today inshallah we're gonna um, talk about and uh, explain founding father of farming page 22. Fou founding father of farming, Mu'assis Ilmi Al-Zira'a, okay. Ibn Bassal or Ibn Bassal, okay was a writer so he was a writer scientist and engineer where did he live he lived in al andalus when in the 11th century okay so who is ibn bassal okay or ibn bassal both are correct writer scientist engineer lived in al andalus in the time uh, what time in the 11th century where did he work he worked in the court of Al Ma'mun. Okay, في قصر أو بلاط Al Ma'mun. Who is Al Ma'mun? Who Who was the king of Toledo? Okay, he was the king of Toledo. His great passion. His refers to Ibn Basal. طبعا any pronoun he has refers to Ibn Basal. His great passion. The most thing he loved were botany. Okay. The most things he loved were botany. Botany, it means, الملنبات, as you see, with B, which is the study of plants. And agriculture. Although he was a great scholar, he was also a practical man. Practical man, رجل عملي, okay? He loved to make experiments with his own hands. بحب يعمل كل إشي بإيده. To try everything by himself. And all of his writing, okay? We said that he was a writer. So all of his writing came from his own hands on, okay? تجارب he did by himself with his own hands. Experience of working the land. بعمله بالأرض. This is the main paragraph about Ibn Bassal, okay, the main information about him. The second paragraph, it's about his achievements, okay, the second paragraph, a, a, a paragraph about the achievements. One of the many things which Ibn Bassal achieved was a book of, was a book of agriculture, so his main achievement is his book. What's the name of the book? A book of agriculture, okay. Now, we're going to talk here about the book. The book consisted of 16 chapters, okay? 16 chapters, 16 juzo, which explain, all of these chapters explain how best to grow trees. What is the best way to grow? Ashan nizra. Trees, fruit and vegetables as well as herbs, okay, الأعشاب كمان, with sweet smelling flowers. Perhaps the most famous chapter, أكتر جزء كان كتير إن شهر, of all was the one, with A, that described how to treat different types of soil, okay, أكتر جزء إن شهر من الكتاب, who how to treat different types of soil. Ibn Bassal also, so this is number one of his achievement. Number two, he worked out, okay, how to irrigate the land by finding underground water. Kif nisqi al-ard by finding underground water and digging wells, okay. He designed water pumps, okay, sammam madakhat la dakhilmiya and irrigation systems all of these things okay here we're talking about two and three were passed on through his writing الانجازات تبعته كتبها okay او ذكرها في كتاباته the last paragraph about the influence of ibn bassal's book okay what was the influence? The influence of Ibn Bassal's book was enormous, huge, very big, okay? How come it's very big? What's the influence? 
farmers down the generations okay farmers down the generations followed his instruction and advice okay so what was the result of following the instruction and the advice of Ibn Bassal the results was the land the earth became wonderfully fertile fertile it means khasbe okay lazira and the land also produced antajat more than enough food for the fast growing population so what was the result of his um, uh, of the instruction or of the farmers that followed his instruction the result was very nice the land became fertile and it produced more than enough food for the fast growing population the irrigation system nidam al ray okay for we see that he and his followers put in place are still in evidence listato dalil in spain يعني لهلا موجود في spain okay although his name is not widely known ibn bassal's legacy what's the legacy of ibn bassal you may have this question what was the legacy of ibn bassal we're going to talk about his achievements okay he, we said here one two and three Ibn Bassal's legacy to the world has been great. Nice text. This is the mind map him. Founding father of farming. The first paragraph, we talked about Ibn Bassal in general. Many uh, general information, information about him. He was a scientist, writer, engineer, scholar. He loves botany. His main passion is botany and agriculture. Uh, he lived in Al-Andalus in the 11th century. He worked at the Ma'moon Al -Ma court. Uh, he was a very practical man. He loved or he tried everything. Okay. Uh, then he uh, passed all of the information to his book. The second paragraph about his achievements, the book of agriculture, in 16 chapters. In the most famous chapter about how to treat soil كيف يعالج أهم جزء عن معالجة التربة number two he um, found irrigation how to irrigate the land and digging water وبرضو صمم مضخات للمياه و irrigation system the last paragraph about the league, sorry uh, the influence of Ibn Bassal okay كيف كان تأثيره he was okay he has a great influence okay enormous the influence was very enormous كيف كان تأثيره؟ أعطيني الجملة اللي بتدل على إنه it was great enormous إنه uh, farmers okay down the, the generations followed his instruction اتبعوا تعليماته so what was the result of following the instruction the land became fertile the land produced enough food for the, for the population